Sean Soriano is gonna meet Christus Jagos and uh, God said uh, Sean Soriano is uh, pretty much well-rounded fighter. He had a UFC tenure six years ago, but now he's getting back on big door. Five foot nine fighter, seventeen inches is his reach. Fighting out of Boca Raton, Florida, fourteen six is uh, his score, and he had ups and downs. At UFC, he suffered three back-to-back -back losses to Tatsuya Kawajiri, Charles Kelly, and Charles Rose. So, but then he competed at Lagos UFC. At CS MMA, he won. Uh, he fought for the vacant CS MMA featherweight championship where he lost to Bryce uh, Boynton. Then he turned the lights out on Solo Almeida. At CFFC, uh, he outworked Jose Mariscal and United Arab Emirates Warriors. He TKO'd Noad Lahat. It's his time to get back into the most powerful promotion in the world. The former interim CFA featherweight champ is uh, pretty much well-rounded fighter, good stamina, good striking, good on the ground, excellent jokes. Now he's gonna meet Christos Diagos. Christos Diagos 5'10", uh, 71 uh, inches is his reach, considering uh, Sean Soriano said he didn't know there is no much big, there is no big significant uh, reach advantage. 18-8 is uh, Diagos' score. Diagos uh, is uh, the former TPF and RFA lightweight uh, champion. At UFC, at his first run, he scored victory over Jorge de Oliveira, then lost to Chris Fade. Right now, he suffered the losses to Charles Oliveira and Raka Klose, but he outfrog Mizuto Hirota, Damir Hadjovic, and Carlton Minus. So, I expect pretty much great fight. This guy is a heck of a striker, also good with chokes. Kind of clash of two similar styles. I I have doubts that somebody's gonna get knocked out here. I would say over 2.5 for this match. Both of these guys are very, very tough and always ready to fight until the last dime, dime breath. This is the clash of two pretty much similar fighters, similar fighting styles. I think Sean Soriano was very, very good against Noad Lahat. I watched that fight and I think he was very, very good. I think he's in a better shape. He's in a better shape right now. So, my primary pick is over 2.5, and yeah, I have to pick one guy, so I'm gonna pick uh, Sean Soriano to win this one. Can't wait for it to kick off.